all right good day viewers this is don vip in this video i'll be showing us how to configure our firefox browser before we start clicking all these um, videos i'm uploading just for our safety now before you start clicking you need to configure your firefox understand the reason why we're configuring your firefox is for safety purpose now do you know that only your vpn alone is not safe yes it's not safe only the vpn you have it's not even okay so you need to configure your firefox browser to avoid any form of trace from google that you are doing self clicking Do you understand now not self clicking it's it go it's again google policy Do you understand now even if you share your app to somebody else in nigeria by the time you have 10 or 5 people clicking your app google will know that you are doing self clicking maybe you actually shared your app within nigeria and you know definitely your app is supposed to go outside nigeria because they believe your app should be on play store so not only nigerians are actually using it so everybody should be using your apps so that means if you click in nigeria somebody should click somewhere else so that's why we're using vpn but now if you use vpn only and did not do one or two settings it will still be shown in their database that you are doing self clicking now this is what i mean let me open my firefox browser you've downloaded fire i believe you have, you all have firefox on your phone i believe you all have firefox on your phone okay now let's go to this address ua.net there's this site they call ua.net it shows everything about your your phone where you're chatting from and all that if you can as you can see in this first column this page i zoomed my ip address is showing i see it that's my phone ip address now my location is showing i see it nigeria is showing <laughs> My network ISP, that internet service provider network is showing, Airtel Nigeria. Then my operating system, that means the operating system of the phone I'm using is Android phone. Android is showing. Then the browser I'm using is Firefox. So if you just on your VPN, okay, if you just on your VPN and you want to start clicking, yeah, if you on your VPN, your location will change. Your ISP might change, but your operating system will not change. Your IP will not change. Your browser will not change. You see that you are still at risk. Now, the essence of this video is to disable all these things and look at this place again. This IP address is still showing. You see, Nigeria is showing. That means if you are clicking, they will know you are clicking from Nigeria. And this web RTC, web trace, that's web track, everything. This web track is supposed to be web trace is supposed to be disabled. So I will show you how to configure Firefox to disable all of these settings so that you can actually browse anonymously. Okay, for example, now let me own my VPN. Don't worry, this video, the video is a bit lengthy, but it's for your own good. You need to watch the video before you start clicking. Now, let me on a VPN now. Let's see, I'm owning this um, as VPN master, for example. Don't worry, this video is very rich. You enjoy it. Okay, United States. Now, I'm connecting from United States. Now, let me go to Ua.net. I want you to understand the essence of the reason why we are configuring this browser. Now, let me reload the page. I'll reload the page now. Yeah. <clears throat> okay, I've reloaded the page now. As you can see, my IP is showing. You see, my location is United States because of the video I'm using. My ISP has changed to Colo Crossing. My host name is, has changed to something, but my browser and operating system still remain the same. That means they can still trace me. Understand? See my IP address 192. All these things, I don't want this Apple address to show, and I don't want my my device to show. So I need to change this thing. And so whether you're using VPN or not, Google can still track you a little. Although it 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 won't be too obvious, sha. Sure. You understand? So I want us to actually be totally safe while clicking. So okay, now let me go back and turn off my VPN. Turn off my VPN. I've turned it off. Okay, if I reload the page now, it's late. I'm from Nigeria also just like the previous page now let's not waste I don't want us to dwell on this let's quickly round up with the settings in Nigeria and all that now the first thing you do now I want us to I want to configure the Firefox now for us to be safe the first thing you do is go to this page mm -hmm. as you can see you erase and you type about okay about pre or semicolon then you put config config means configuration about configuration that's about config make sure it's well spelled c o n f i f i g okay then you go once you go it brings you to this place now what do i want to do i want to toggle on and off something you see what i want to actually 
um, is the IP actually that I want to toggle on and off. I want the that web trace, that's web trace, that then uh, web TRC to be, to be disabled so that my IP will not be displaying. Okay. Then here in this search box, you type media dot. Make sure there is no space. Dot um, peer connection connection dots enable okay you see i've tapped enable now you see that okay let me erase this enable small let me leave it here on that e enable now or oh, okay complete it enable now under this place now you see that my my media connect is is true i need to turn it off i need to make it false once you touch it now you see this toggle button touch the toggle button now it's not false let it be false okay then you go back that's what i need you just need to make sure that your media this thing is not false if you scroll down it's covered that this this uh, web rtc is now disabled my ip is not like false measure you are safe now but my network is still showing right my android whatever is still showing now i want to remove this um user this user engine i want to change this agent now to what they call random user agent do you understand how do you do that now go to your settings under settings you see so you go to your menu rather sorry you go to your this three button menu then you come to add-ons okay now under this add-ons click on browse firefox add-ons we need to download a particular add-ons called random user agent okay random user agent okay now under this add-ons you come here and you find add-ons which add-ons am i looking for i'm looking for random user random user agents okay this is it random user agent let me just type it in full so that we all know what i'm looking for random user agent that's the first one i'll tap it now now these add-ons you need to install it don't worry it's not going to install like application on your phone it only install itself itself in this firefox now i've added it to firefox it's installing i'll show you what this random user agent see it requires permission to access your data file website yes see add once you add installation complete add-ons is okay now now that's all you, that's all you need to do you go back now you go back again you go back let's go to award.net let me refresh the page as you can see my location is still nigeria my isp is existing but look at my operating system now it has changed to window 8 as if i'm using window 8 and i'm using android phone you can see my browser it has changed to chrome it has changed to chrome 68 these are these are and look at my settings here is this table let me use uh, a vpn i've turned on my vpn let's see the magic so okay my vpn is connected i come back to my firefox and i reload the page you should notice something all right as you can see my is now United States, ISP, Colo Crossing, my operating system is Windows 8.1, Google Chrome 6. You see, everything is changing. Everything has changed. So I'm actually doing my clicking in Abuja, in Abuja here in Nigeria, and at the same time, none of my information is showing. None of my information is showing. Okay, now this user is an agent. I want to show something. Under this um, um, add-ons um random user agent i want us to just adjust on the two settings as you can see three random user agents is enabled chrome linux and windows so i can just integrate firefox make it don't make it too obvious internet explorer 10 rather sorry then uh, opera linux uh opera mac and then uh, firefox and uh, no, no firefox safari iphone then these are now I've integrated more more user agents so it will be switching agents now okay uh, I think that should be all I need to do for now 
okay then you go back you go back automatically changes the agent after a specified period of time okay after 10 minutes no let me make it uh, uh if i make your own let me make it um two minutes okay that's all for now then i'll then i'll go back and done just go back your settings will be saved automatically so i'm done now once i refresh the page after two minutes my user agent will change you see mac os opera 4.4 oh this is wonderful don't worry it's because my vpn is off that's why it's showing nigeria ah google don't suffer all right that's all about how to configure our firefox browser hope this video is helpful thank you you can please try as much as possible to subscribe to my youtube channel thank you